All right, Emma and I are gonna review how to perform a barbell front squat. Just a real quick note about this video. Because of the angle of my rack, it's really difficult to teach you how to do the grips. So we're gonna be racking and unracking from the backwards position. I'll show you the correct way at the end of the video. So we're gonna go through different grip styles. If you're a newbie, you can use any of these grip styles that work for you. Um, some of them are maybe a little bit more equipment than others. So just be thinking about that. All of them are completely fine places to start. And the first most easiest way is with, I'm using pillowcases, which is a really classy move. Mm -hmm. <laughs> a lot of gyms have straps. You can use straps. You could even use your socks. Take off your socks and grip them around. Uh, but basically what we've done is we've got the pillowcases just wrapped around symmetrically on both sides. And then to get into a front squat position, Emma's gonna slide under the bar. Now the goal with front squat is to get the bar resting across your chest and shoulders. In this position, it can feel a little bit uncomfortable against your throat. That's normal, expect it, it gets easier and more comfortable. Elbows are trying to point straight towards the other side of the room on the wall, like lasers. Now to unwrap, she's just gonna lift up, walk it forward. Remember, this is not the correct way, but we're gonna show you so you can see it from the front and perform her squat. Great, straight down, straight up, and re-rack it. So that's the, probably the easiest grip to start with if you've never done these before. The next place to start would be arms crossed across your chest. Same thing, we want that bar as close to our body as possible, resting on the soft parts of our shoulders, elbows pointed towards the wall in front of you. She'll unrack it, walk it forward. This way, I find, is a little more unstable and uneasy. Straight down, straight up, re-rack it back. Same thing though, it'll get the job done. The next level from that is a two finger grip. So you wanna line yourself up equally on both sides using the knurling. You place two fingers on, same style, slide underneath it, elbows pointing now. Now the two fingers are kind of hooked under holding it. And full squat, elbows up. Good, and walk it back. And then the final most advanced grip for a front squat is gonna be a full on either hook grip or full grip. This is really tough for beginners to do, so don't stress if you can't do it. A lot of people can't. You don't have to be able to do this. This is great if you're wanting to pursue Olympic weightlifting. So let's see if Emma can do it. Good. She looks pretty good, but it looks tough, right? Elbows struggle to get really high. That's fine. She'll do her squat. Elbows high. Yep. Good. And then re-rack it. Those are the four ways you can practice grip or use grip with a front squat. I'm going to bring Emma down now to the true position. This is how we want you to unrack a front squat. The setup is going to be the exact same as a back squat, barbell setup, shoulder height, use whatever grip you want. You're gonna slide underneath it, pick it up off the bar, take one step back, and then perform your squat from there. Go for it. Great, and walk it back in. So with the front squat, it's really tough to get in that position. There are other techniques you can do to work on it but there is no better way than just to practice. Let us know if you have any questions.